Hey guys, how you doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal Edge Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. As you can see, look at my living room, very well lit. As you can see, it's not dark in here at all whatsoever. The reason why I say this is because you see a lot of demonstrations on YouTube of people demonstrating their screens being magnificent or amazing, and yet they're always subjected to a dark environment, and that's something you don't have to do with when deal with when it comes with our screen. So, you know, if you want to use your uh, projector in a fully lit environment with our Immerse 4K Cinema screens, you can do so. As we speak downstairs, I have the I have a, bought a 150 inch fixed screen screen, which is actually being converted to an Immerse screen. All right, so I'm going to show you where my projector is landed from the wall from here we are more than 11 feet about 11 feet and some change let me show you my projector now I don't see the point of using a 4200 lumen projector I believe is just overkill as I always say it's just way too many lumens it's a lot of lumens at 11 even 12 feet even 13 feet away even at 14 feet away you're talking about 4200 lumens hitting a 100 inch screen all right so right here we're using a cat seal projector this is lamp free lamp free there's no lamp in there whatsoever so these projectors can't burn out you can run them all day long there's no lamp in them at all uh, this is a dlp projector also two DLP projector. This is a hybrid projector. It's actually laser and lead. Uh, those of you who are curious about the specifications of my projector, I will put the model number of the projector in the description or at the bottom of the video. All right, so 2,500 lumens, about 11 feet and some change away from the screen. We are going to watch this demonstration in a fully lit environment. Our screen's not going to wash out. It's not going to fade. The reason why some people have to use these high power projectors is to make the screen look better. And like I said, at one at at this point, when you're using that caliber of uh, 4,000, 4,200, 4, I don't know, 4,500, I don't know, 5,000, 6,000 lumens, at this particular point, you the projector is now doing all the work. All right, the screen's doing nothing. So you want to be to come home, set up your screen, and be done with it. Now I'm gonna show you something else too. Something I've never had to do with any of my projectors. All right, take it off blank mode real quick. Now I'm gonna show you something really quick. Look at this. This is my menu of my projector. None of my settings are ever changed. See brightness, all the same. Everything is set to the factory settings. Nothing changed, which means I didn't have to go through the painstaking nightmare of calibrating my projector. And you'll have some people out there have you try to have you believe that by calibrating your projector actually expands the life of the projector. It does not. Calibrating your projector is for basically color balance, uh, basically for trying to get the best color possible um, out of your projector. But calibrating a projector has nothing to do with the life of the projector. You can look that up on ABS forms, even though I don't like ABS forms, but you can look it up on ABS forms. You can Google that. It has nothing to do with the life of your projector. If you basically mistreat your projector and you burn it 24 seven, yeah, eventually that lamp is gonna go. You're gonna eat through your lamp life, but it has nothing to do with calibration. It has nothing to do with uh, the life of your projector at all, period. Only thing calibration does is basically is adjust and calibrate the color or contrast or so forth of the screen has nothing to do with the, the life of the projector. I don't know where somebody got the idea from that one from. All right, so let's begin. Start a demonstration um, using the Chromecast on the back of my projector. And I'm streaming it off my cell phone. So I'm going to go back a minute on this video over here. And we are going to begin. There we go. Let's see. And I forgot to remove that off the screen. My fault, people. Let me get that off the screen first and let's begin again. I am so sorry. I kind of forgot that was up there. All right. So this is what my screen looks like in a fully lit room. 11 feet away on an uncalibrated projector, mind you. With only 2,500 lumens. And that's one of the things I didn't like about some of these big companies. They would have these really high power projectors one particular company of mine i'm not going to say the name but they had this projector literally it was the size of a coffee table and this thing was 
10,000 lumens. It was an ultra short though laser projector and it was sitting four inches from the screen. That's not impressive. Look at this. And it's the same thing when you go to these places like Best Buy and they have these showrooms. And in these showrooms they have these 4,000 and 5,000 lumen projectors and they're sitting 11 and 12 feet from the screen and they're doing it in an ambient light environment. Yes, that's the projector, it's not the screen. Go home and use your projector that's not 4K and doesn't have all the bells and whistles and your screen's gonna fail. It's gonna look horrible. So look at this. my angle gain right there looks the same way as it does all the way around I think excuse me walking past the projector I'll just show you on any angle right here I am in my dining room look at my screen this is an uncalibrated projector this is right out of the box never touched never had to touch any of my settings Okay, let's grab something else. So I can get my cell phone to work right here. Okay, let's go out of here for a minute. So that's why I don't, I don't get it. I don't know why anybody. I mean, yeah, it's fantastic. You're gonna be doing some certain things. Yeah, you know, watching movies and so forth. But who wants to be subjected to a dark environment? I mean, 24/7. I know I don't want to be a dark. I don't want to be in a dark environment 24/7. How beautiful that looks. Fully lit. Just switching back and forth, guys. Well, see, the beautiful thing about this is when it comes to calibrating your projector, that is a painstaking nightmare it is. Some pe people, some people don't want to go through that. You know, some people that will calibrate their projector, that's them. But you have your average Joe, they just want to take the screen, set it up, and then the next thing they want to do is just go in, set up their projector, and be done with it. That's it. You know, they don't want all that technical nonsense along with it. They just want something simple, something they can come in, it's going to have a beautiful screen, they can use it in a fully lit environment. The screen is just going to look gorgeous on so many levels, and they don't have to worry about having a, a, a ton of lumens in order to execute the screen. They don't have to worry about calibrating the projector. They don't have to worry about the ambient lit environment or whether or not they have a window next to the screen. They don't want to worry about that. They want to be able to treat their projection screen just like a TV. 
It can, you can use your TV in a fully lit room and go through all the, the you know, it, it can just survive in all the different environments. And why can't you do the same with your projection screen? Why do you have to have such in, insane lumens just to be able to execute perfect picture quality? Look at this. Look how gorgeous that looks. 2,500 lumens, uncalibrated, never touch, all set to factory settings. This is how amazing these screens look. Okay guys, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Edge Technology Screens. I hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Um, I'm going to be setting up downstairs pretty soon. I ordered a 150 inch fixed frame that's going to be uh, coated to an immersed screen downstairs. And then up here, I'm going to be building my giant mass of 90, 190 inch, maybe 200 inches if I can get it to fit. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. Just going to let it play a little bit through. Man, that is just gorgeous. Look at this fully lit environment. And as you can see, we don't have the room peppered with a few lights littered around the room with lamps on them. It looks, this is how bright and vivid my room is. This is how illuminated my living room is. Look at this. Okay, again, let's see if we can grab something else. Just really quick. I know it's supposed to sign out, guys. I'm really enjoying the screen. I really am. Awesome. Got a commercial. This is awesome. I'm doing this video about a hundred thousand times. Been that one way too many times. All right, do this one right here. I know I, si I signed out off already, guys, but just gotta show you a little bit more. I'm sorry, I really, really love this screen. You have no idea. Cannot wait to get the 150, 100, sorry, 190 inch built. how insane that looks. Man, that looks incredible. Got to go into the next room. I got to. I got to see this on the angle. Oops, I'm tripping off the measuring tape. Oh, that is so freaking beautiful. Look at that. I'm telling you, I never get used to the immersed screens. I never get used to them. I can't get used to them. These screens are incredible. Look at this. Right over here in my corner. Just kneel down right here. Check this out. That is gorgeous. Batman is freaking loving the screen. You love the screen, Batman? I absolutely love it. <laughs> Sorry, the worst Batman impression, but wow, it looks gorgeous. I am really happy with this, this, this new technology. Really, really happy with it. Let's grab something else. Okay guys, I'm gonna sign off here. Just let it play through a little bit, but again, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for ordering. Um, like I said, the blackout fall. Oh, I can't wait, you're gonna be seeing that next because this whole entire area is gonna be filled with the 190 inch customized immersed 4K cinema screen, and it is gonna be done in all the new stretch blackout fall. Look at this. Imagine just coming in and just turning on your projector. Boom, this is your screen. I still have lights in my environment, it doesn't make a difference. Lights on, lights off, lights on, lights off, lights on. Okay, we get out of here. You guys all have a good one. Thank you all for watching.